So, our next topic is work problems involving linear inequalities. Okay? So, when you are given a work problem, let's say you are told a variable this is added to this. So, normally, we like to assume that the variable is x. So, that's the first thing we assume. So, our variable or whatever we have been asked to find, we are going to name it x. So, assuming they tell you a number is added to 2. So, what is that number? Let's assume that the number is x. So, x plus 2. So, that is the number added to what? 2. When I tell you 5 times a number, it means if this is x, it means 5 times a number means 5 times x, which is what? 5x. Okay? So, when I tell you um, a number is added to 2 and then equated to what? 7. Okay? So, a number x is added to 2 and then equated to 7. Something like this. So, normally the best thing to do is to what? Name a variable x for the missing number which you are going to find and then you solve it. So, let's pick an example.